For all intents and purposes, dueling in Red Dead Redemption should be straightforward and easy. And technically, it really is. However, with the new PlayStation and Nintendo Switch port, dueling isn't necessarily as straightforward as one would think. While engaging in duels, I've noticed some inconsistencies in how your gun's reticle changes colors, how it used to operate on the old PS3, and also with the new PlayStation and Nintendo Switch port. The two problems with duels in Red Dead Redemption are the very vague and poor in-game tutorial provided by the game's developers, and also the game's coding and subsequent conversion. The in-game tutorial should only appear once when you attempt your first ever duel, and not only does it appear on screen briefly, but it's short on information. Nonetheless, you should always press L2 to draw the left trigger on Xbox and L button, or left bumper on Nintendo Switch, and keep holding it. Then raise your right thumbstick onto the enemy NPC's body, and keep an extremely close watch on your gun's reticle as you raise it. As soon as you see your gun's reticle change from red to white, fire and keep firing. It can and should change to white more than once, so you want to get as many shots in as possible. The purpose of watching your reticle change colors from red to white and getting as many shots off as possible is in order to have your blue scale, in the bottom right corner of the screen, fill up faster and reach a higher point on the scale than the enemy NPC's red scale. And if you don't do this, you will lose the duel. The in-game tutorial included an alternative method to using L2 to draw, and I highly advise against using this alternative method. The alternative method simply involves holding down on the right thumbstick, instead of pressing and holding L2. Then from there you raise your right thumbstick as usual and watch for the reticle to change from red to white. This worked fine on the old PS3, and I've included a link in the description below to IGN's Dual Guide, in which you can see how the entire reticle clearly changes from red to white. However, with the PlayStation and Nintendo Switch port, if you use this alternative method, only a small area of the reticle will briefly change to a faint pink. Now perhaps some of you might be thinking or saying, you know, this isn't really a big deal, but this threw me off, and it might throw some of you off as well, using this alternative method uh, through the Nintendo Switch and PlayStation port. So I advise this using the simple L2 method. Here's another example where I pushed down on the right thumbstick and then pushed up to draw instead of using L2. You'll notice again the reticle turns to a faint pink. There is a few moments in there very briefly where it turns to white, but for the most part it's pink, a faint pink. And again, this is just to emphasize or make the observation again to not use this method when playing on Nintendo Switch or on the PlayStation. Finally, if you want to practice dueling or try out both methods yet can't find a dueling NPC in any town or settlement, simply change your outfit to the elegant suit, which you can purchase from the Thieves Landing tailor and enter a game of blackjack. The elegant suit will provide you with the option of cheating, and if you get caught cheating by an NPC, they will challenge you to a duel. And there's no mistaking there, the reticle went clearly white as I used the L2 method. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.